Excuse me, do you have anything else? Excuse me. Yes, miss. Hmm. I've been waiting for 10 minutes. I thought someone would bring me to the table, but no one came. I want the menu. I'm really hungry, you know? What kind of service is this? Sorry, miss. I apologize for the inconvenience. Let me go and get the menu. What would you like to order? Hot water or cold water? Cold water, please. Thank you. Okay. I want the Caesar salad. Sorry, miss. This dish is not available right now. I suggest you to order the zucchini rose salad. And what is this? It's one of the signature dishes of our restaurant. Most of the customers prefer this meal. I think you should try it. Is it nice? Yes, it is. Okay, then. Excuse me, miss. Thank you. Excuse me. Yes, miss. Why your food is so sour? Oh my god, I cannot eat it. Why it's so sour? What you put inside her? I'm not sure about that. Why this one is not fresh? Look at this. Why is not fresh? Sorry, miss, but it was fresh. Where got fresh? Where got fresh? You think this one is fresh? It's not fresh at all. What to talk about your food, your flour? Even your flour is not fresh. Oh my god. Call the manager or someone. If you don't know what is this. Hi miss, our manager isn't in right now. But I'm the supervisor. How can I help you? Okay. Explain to my why your salad is so sour. Why is it so sour? I have few problem, but secondly, your food is not fresh at all. You look at your mushroom, is it fresh? Look, look, see this one. This one, eyes one. I'm sorry about issue. See, the thing is, the dressing on the salad actually makes it sour, but for the freshness of the ingredients, we have to apologize. We are going to solve this problem by giving you a new dish, a new salad, and it's going to be half prints all right. So we just hope that you enjoy your experience here, and we really again, I have to apologize on behalf of the whole restaurant, the whole management for this incident. Okay. You have a nice day. Our waiter will bring you the dish shortly. Welcome to our restaurant. Today, we're talking about how to handle a fussy customer. First, it's important to listen to their concerns. It shows you care and want to make things right. 
Next, try to empathize with them. Put yourself in their shoes and imagine how you feel in their situation. Remember, the customer is always right. Even if they're not, it's important to remain polite and professional. Finally, offer a solution. Whether it's a new dish or a discount on their meal, find a way to make it right. By handling fussy customers with care and professionalism, you can turn a negative experience into a positive one. Thanks for watching.